To create a ClickSense data connection to an Amazon Redshift database, open a ClickSense app or create a new app and select Add Data. Select Amazon Redshift. To connect to your Amazon Redshift database, specify the host name for the data warehouse. Amazon Redshift uses port 5439 by default. If you have set up Amazon Redshift to use a different port, change the default port number. Enter the name of the Amazon Redshift database you want to access. Enter the username and password for the database. Select the SSL settings you want to use when connecting to your database. SSL support in Amazon Redshift is strictly for encrypting the connection between your client and your cluster. If you are connecting through a proxy, enter the name or address of the proxy server and the proxy port. You can leave these fields empty if you are not connecting through a proxy. At the bottom of the connection dialog, you can enter a new name for the connection or you can leave the default name. Click Create to create the connection that will be used when selecting and loading data from the database. To select data, select an owner from the Owner drop-down list. The tables available to that owner appear in the Tables menu. Select a table to preview the data in the Data Preview window. In the Data Load Editor, Click Load Data. Your Amazon Redshift data is now available in your ClickSense app. And that concludes this video. Thanks for watching.